Hello ladies and gentlemen, it is me Ubuntu Hellguy with a review of the new uh, Ubuntu GNOME Remix 12.10 So uh, here it is and uh, finally I guess I could say because some of you guys have been waiting on this GNOME 3 release of Ubuntu 12.10 So um, yeah I gotta say to start with, this is the most beautiful uh, login screen by far, uh, made by Linux. So it's very simple and I really really like that. Now the reason for um, what you call this new GNOME edition of uh, Ubuntu is because many people don't like the Unity interface. And uh, I understand that because in the beginning I was totally freaked out by uh, Unity, but uh, right now I really like it actually. But uh, let's get on with this review. So first off I just click and let's log in. So it says session right here. Uh, we have system default, uh, GNOME and GNOME Classic. So uh, that's very nice to get these options. But I'll just log in right here. And here we go. Ubuntu 12.10 GNOME Remix Now I'm not sure if they are gonna keep the name uh, Ubuntu Remix, Ubuntu GNOME Remix I mean So uh, let's just see what the name is gonna turn out to be Now remember this is the uh, beta version of 12.10 uh, um, Ubuntu GNOME Remix I guess So uh, let's move on Now uh, activities If I click on that we will see the standard web browser by default is a Epiphany web browser. Uh, we've got evolution email client right here and our empathy client. Uh, Rhythmbox is the uh, standard music player. Shotwell is the standard uh, image viewer. And we have our files and help. Now remember you can customize this doc right here. And so far it looks a bit like, or a lot like a normal GNOME uh, 3 interface. Um, I'm not really familiar with GNOME 3, so uh, this is going to be exciting for me. Uh, as you can see we've got this search bar up here, and stuff like that. So uh, if I click show applications, and actually if I go to system tools, and scroll down to system monitor, you will actually see that it says uh, release 12.10 console 32-bit uh, and it says GNOME 3.6.0 so uh, this is uh, GNOME 3.6 so far so uh, that's very nice actually if we go back into our activities right here and go to uh, show applications I will just show you some of the applications uh, that are included in this GNOME version of Ubuntu. So in accessories we've got just the standard applications uh, such as terminal which you will need if you're a Linux user uh, obviously. We've got archive manager, calculator, just you know the standard applications. If we click games we've got the whole suite of uh, GNOME games right here. So that's very nice if you are a gamer guy I guess. In graphics, we've got document viewer, image viewer, shot well, and simple scan. Just standard um, applications installed by default. In internet, we will see desktop sharing, empathy, quiver, uh, transmission, and of course the uh, Epiphany web browser. In office, now Right here you see Abbey Word, but you don't see LibreOffice, so that is actually kind of weird that uh, by default in this version that they don't uh, include uh, LibreOffice. Um, I'm not sure if they're gonna do that in the final release, but uh, so far we've only got Abbey Word, so uh, sorry. In other applications we've just got disk image mounting mounter something. In uh, programming, we've got nothing so far by default. In sound and video, we've got Brasero, Cheese, uh, Webcam, Application and Movie Player, Rhythmbox, and Sound Recorder. 
Now, as you can see right here, cheese is installed by default. If we move down to system tools, you will see that dconf editor is installed by default, which is very nice. Also, we've got UX term, uh, X term, X diagnose. Uh, we've also got tweak tools and uh, system monitor, system settings. So actually, I'll just try to open system settings for you guys. And let me move this. Right here, if we go to appearance, because I know a lot of you guys are really interested in uh, wallpapers and stuff like that. So uh, we've got a whole suit of uh, lovely wallpapers here. Very, very nice. Um, I've chosen this wallpaper right here. It's called Space Flare. And also the wallpapers are in uh, huge resolutions. Uh, the theme is of course Adwaita, which is the default GNOME 3 theme. If we go back to activities and go to uh, show applications. In Universal Access, right here we've got Orca and Onboard right here. So uh, if I open up the files you will see that it is obviously the standard at waiter or it at waiter I don't know how you pronounce that uh, theme that we've got on this version of Ubuntu 12.10 in system tools we've got the software right here uh, now this is the alternative to uh, Ubuntu software center so it's right here it's very nice uh, it's the same software center as in uh, the previous versions of Linux Mint. As you can see Ubuntu One application is nowhere to be found and that is mostly because it really doesn't look like a GNOME app so uh, you won't find the GNOME, you know, uh, the Ubuntu One application right here. So that was just a quick look review of the uh, new version of Ubuntu 12.10 the GNOME Remix or whatever you would like to call it. So thank you for watching, have a nice day and I will catch you guys in the next one. Peace out, Girl Scout.